Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. Today we are in Kelly Park. We are about 40 minutes outside of Orlando and we're taking a break from the theme parks. We're gonna be hiking and checking out the campground and checking out the water spots and all the things that you can do here at Kelly Park. Um, so let's get to it. When we arrived in Kelly Park, we were greeted by a gate attendant. We paid $5 for three or more people to get into the gate. Um, that would give us access to everything in the park. We got a park map and um, we had a couple questions and she very much helped us out. She gave us more information than we needed and she was super helpful. The first trail that we are attempting today is the Kelly Loop Trail. It is basically dirt and sand, like white sand, it's really nice. Um, yeah, it runs along the natural lazy river, which we'll get to later. Brushing up on your uh, snake spotting skills. I just don't want to see any snakes. A bobcat, so cool a black see a bear, turtle or a deer or a turkey or a bear. I would like to see that. Or an owl, or white-tailed oh, deer. Work with that? I not a bear, a not a snake, not a bobcat. Prize pine cone. Somebody put it on this bench. <laughs> okay, so we just stumbled upon something. I don't know, maybe it's common and we just don't realize it. But um, when we originally looked at the map, when deciding what we were gonna do, we noticed that there was a um, map legend that said sinkhole and we saw a bunch of those symbols along the route that we were gonna take. I thought that was pretty cool. I didn't really know what to expect. Maybe like a little hole and it would be considered a sinkhole. So we just got to our first one. And the thing you can, McAllister's actually standing in it. I don't know if that's actually safe. Um, I don't know much about sinkholes, but you, when you hear about them, you just hear they're not good. So let's go see. Oh my gosh. I don't even know if I want to stand here. That is a sinkhole. There's supposed to be this one, and there was two more on the sides. I don't know. And then there's gonna be another one. Oh my gosh, it looks like it's gonna be a bigger one that we go around in a minute. You see? Yeah, it looks like we're going like right through it. Well, this was the small one that we just ran upon. And then there's another one that we're gonna go. Yeah, I don't know. Or is this it? Is this it? Cause it's really close. I wonder if we're about to actually, we're going kind of in and around the sinkhole. Oh my gosh. Surely they wouldn't lead us to danger, knowingly anyway. <laughs> so one of the coolest things about Kelly Park um, Rock Springs is the natural spring that they have here. So there is a natural spring that, it's like a natural lazy river that runs down and then in the middle of the natural lazy river, there's like a spring where it's like a big body of water. So if you don't wanna do the lazy river and you just kinda of wanna swim, you can hang out in the water. We just kind of, Came over here to dip our toes in. It's like freezing cold. I 
think the temperature stays at 72 year round, um, which is pretty nice. And it's very clear and it's just like moving at a small light pace. If you do um, want to ride the Lazy River, you can bring your own floats or you can rent some right outside the park when you come in. Um, you'll see people driving with their floats like on the sides of their car. So it has to be like right before you get here. Um, but also, yeah, you can bring yours. We didn't bring any today and we didn't rent any today. We just wanted to do a little hiking and check this place out. Um, I think it takes about an average of 30 minutes to ride the springs. So you can just keep going back on it. It's um, got like some little rocks and there's like a paved path as you go in um, you can walk on a paved path and then when you get out of the um, natural spring you actually walk right out onto the paved path and you can just go back and it takes like maybe five minutes to walk back 10 minutes yeah not long like a five to ten minute walk to walk from the each end so it's not very far um, so I could see kids wanting to come here for the whole day swim tube all day it's really cool before this was our first time at Kelly Park we looked it up on the internet and basically winged it we for sure are gonna have to come back we're gonna have to tent camp we're gonna have to do the springs we're just gonna have to do all of it maybe for like a weekend um yeah so at one point there was a spot where you could walk around um, and we saw that there was water. So we just walked right off the trail. Um, it's like a little loop and we saw kayaks. So you can rent kayaks. You can just drive right out of Kelly Park and just drive down a couple of minutes and um, you can rent kayaks and it's the same type of water that you see here at the Springs. Um, it's just really nice and pretty. So that was really cool. We saw a couple of kayakers and um, that was probably my favorite part. Like I, I really want to do that one day. Um, we saw deer. There was a couple of white tailed deer. They were not scared of us at all. Um, we actually saw a lot of wildlife apparently. Um, snakes and lizards. Lizards were everywhere and they were scaring me. Um, the deer, we saw guineas and we saw fish and a bunch of different types of birds. It was really cool. So a couple of different things that you're gonna find it around the parking lot and around this area is there is a playground. There is volleyball, there's basketball. Um, you're gonna find a like a thing right before you walk down to the springs. You're gonna find restrooms and like a deck. And then you're gonna find um, a concession stand. It was not open today. I would assume that it's gonna be open more of busy times, maybe in the summer. And um, it does take cash only. So if it is open, expect to pay cash. So we had a lot of fun here at Kelly Park today. Uh, we spent a couple of hours and we did a good bit. I uh, can't wait to get back here, but for now we have to go back to our hotel, get back to Orlando and do the theme parks. But that we'll see you in the next one. Bye guys.